So some plants grow from cuttings or propagations. We grow yacons, which is a root crop from South America, from rhizomes, in which we save year after year. We got our first plants back in 2014, and we have saved the rhizomes year after year in a bucket of sand at the end of the harvest uh, in the stairwell of the attic, which keeps it chilled, but not frozen. You can also do this on a very smaller scale in the back on the lower shelf of your refrigerator. Now, they grow five to six feet tall and produce a tuber, and each plant in South America can produce about 15 to 30 pounds of these tubers. Here in our garden in Southeast Wisconsin, we average between three to five pounds a plant. Many different things in which you can do with a yacht con, but I'm just gonna show you how we propagate. Now, this has been sitting in the sand over winter, about the, since about the last week in October. And what we've done is we've cleaned the roots up, we put it in the sand, kept the sand, we moistened it when we put it in the bucket, and we haven't touched it since. So it's a little dehydrated there, but what I'm looking at is these uh, rhizomes here that's got the little growth tip on them. So all we'll do is, like on this one here, I've got one, two, three, four potential plants down here is another one right there is five so there's five potential plants on this root ball itself so i'm just going to show you how to do one we just get in there with a sharp knife cut down until we've severed it from the main and just kind of it's kind of like uh cutting potatoes with the eyes on it you want to have enough meat here in order for it to begin to root, and it will root very, very quickly once it comes out of that coolness of the attic stair and comes into your grow area with that 68, 72, 75 degrees. It will start growing. Now, the key to doing this is you want to treat these just like tomatoes. Don't put them out until the frost is over. Frost will kill them. That's an indication that they're ready to harvest. They take six months to bear a flower. Where we're at, we don't get six months. We get about four and a half months. And you want to plant these, as we're doing, inside 90 days before you intend to put them outside. So what I've got here is a, a party cup. You can do this in a plastic container. Uh, we put about an inch of soil at the bottom. And then we just cover it up. And with the warmth of the room here, in about a week, we'll begin to see it start growing. Keep it under our Happy Leaf LED grow lights. And we're good to go. Uh, they do... Uh, we put them in party cups without holes, so we do have to monitor how much we water them. If you put holes in the container or have holes in the container, that's fine. And then when we plant them around the end of May, we can plant them about two foot apart, and they produce very well. Many different things you can do with it. But a yacon, an unusual crop in which we are able to grow very successfully here in our Zone 5 garden. For more information, please visit thewisconsinvegetablegardener.com.